But for the truck today, I just have to go run and grab one more, one more of these clamps and a bar stool end. So something that goes like that, I need to get one of those. And um, I'm gonna do a PCV reroute and I'm also gonna do the resonator uh, delete, which is this guy right here. I'm gonna take off that resonator by the intake and uh, put this cap on to cap it off and it'll make the turbo a little bit louder. This guy is gonna go on the on the vacuum line for the for the PCD. Use these and some heater hose, six feet of heater hose, five eighths inch. Um, this is a half half inch to three quarter inch uh, copper ninety degree from Lowe's, and then this was from like uh, O'Reilly's for a few bucks, and this was like five bucks at O'Reilly's as well. Um, this is the materials needed to do the PCV reroute and the resonator delete. All right, so this guy's gonna come off and we're gonna cap off that guy. And once we take him off, we can see where the P PCV is at and delete that guy. And yeah, so. All right, so got the resonator off. It was just this screw right here. Takes it off and then it's this bolt. Can't really see it, but I don't have that star wrench. So, but it pops right off of this. So it came right off, um, but yeah, so that guy we're not gonna need him anymore I'm gonna throw on the uh, throw on the test plug test plug also known as gym cap all right so this test plug won't go into my inlet so what I did was I took this piece off of the resonator put the test plug into that tightened it up and it is super, super tight. Now I put this back on the inlet and tightened it up right there. So now I'm working on the P PCV reroute. That guy right there is uh, really caked with oil. That is all just oil caked up on there. And then that is going to be capped off with the bar stool cap, and it is just disgusting. Oh my gosh. All that is going into the turbo. Try to get a good view. Uh, but yeah, it's just straight nasty. So I'm going to wipe that clean, cap it off, put a clamp on it, and then we're going to do the the three quarter inch to half inch 90 elbow off of this guy, clamp that, and then run the hose down, down through there, along the uh, along the chassis. And I'm so glad I'm doing this, cause holy crap, that's a lot of oil. So yeah, I'm gonna get that started and I'll come right back. So, we got the bar stool cap on. I had to freaking use a big clamp because I have a very small one that doesn't let me get the bar stool on the vacuum inlet. So I had to use a big one so you can see all that access. I'm gonna try to find one smaller and uh, switch it out. So right now we got this guy, I kind of wiped it clean. And then we got our, our copper 90 degree. Try to get this guy in there and uh, I already got it clamped to the heater hose it's already tied down real tight and this hose is just gonna run all the way down down that way and I'm gonna zip tie it off and just leave the other end open it's just pressure coming out so you don't need to cap it off or anything um, so yeah try to get this guy on it goes on pretty easily that's good because uh, I've been fighting with all this other stuff all day so, I'm gonna get the clap on first, 
and tighten this down and I'll see if I can get the tripod up so you can watch this part. out of this thing because that's gonna suck but there we go so got the 90 in <laughs> those clamps look ridiculous but I got to run with them now and find some shorter ones because those are just way too big but this one on the on the heater hose man is meant for it like damn perfect not so much the big ones um, so yeah now I'm gonna run this hose I'm gonna run it under this it looks like the AC AC line. I'm gonna run it under that. All right, so we're under the truck, and there's the oil filter. Here's our hose right here. Um, so we'll pull it down. And what I'm gonna do is I already zip tied it up there to the radiator hose. So now I'm gonna zip tie it along this these cables here. Let's see if I can get this. So you can understand right along those cables there and we'll run it all right so there we have it heater hose coming down from the engine right up beside the uh, oil filter and then it's going to come down I have a zip tied up there and then zip tied again right there and it just comes down uh, right there and it ends right there BAM Looks like it's picking up faster. Oh yeah, I can I can definitely hear the turbo now. 